What's up YouTube, coming to y'all with another video. We got an exciting video today. We are about to go look at a 2024 S650 Mustang. I'm about to go see one in person finally. If you've seen the previous videos, then you know I went and placed an order for one, but I've never seen them in person. But now we about to go look at one in person. I'm about to go meet T at the dealership. She just came in from off the road. She wants to look at it too, cause she's possibly in the market for a second car. And uh, yeah. Apparently she hates the way the new Mustangs look, but she wants to really like see one in person. She just seen pictures like me. Well, she says she's seen a couple while she's been on the road, but she keeps seeing the back end of them as soon as she noticed them, cause you know, she's in a truck. So yeah, about to head up to Auto Nation Ford Wolf Chase to see what their 2024 Mustang looks like. All right, so let's go. I know she's about to go meet me up there right now. So let's go. All right, and here we are at Auto Nation Ford Wolf Chase. The gate is still open, but I don't see it. The car probably on the inside for all I know. I don't see it nowhere. Oh, well, I'm still waiting on T to pull up too, wherever she's at. Oh, they got a Corvette in there. Oh, they got a scat pack. Well, let's see where she's at. There she go, finally, she's just now pulling up. <laughs> I bet these folks have been looking at me on the inside like, why is this guy just sitting out here? Oh Lord. What's up, roommate? <laughs> yes, I'm recording. I see. Yeah. So do you think seeing this car might change your mind? No. <laughs> Why do you think the car is so ugly? Because it is. No, it's not. It's in the trunk. I no. You see the scat pack right there? I do see the scat pack. I would like to see that one as well. <laughs> you said you said the other one. That got two in there? No, I want to see um that one as well. Oh, okay. <laughs> Smart man. Uh, we actually just we had a, uh, just heard it. I was in maybe two hours ago. We had a uh, same color and everything. We had a challenge. 2022 with like 15,000 miles. 392 heavy. We just plugged right there. We just saw it. I want to say that's right. All right. So, unfortunately, the 2024 Mustang <laughs> I saw online, it's still in route. It's not here yet. So, yeah. But T started looking at these uh, Mopars because she Mopar gang or Chevy. She's everything. I'm about to yeah. Get life for <laughs> yeah. Got two scat packs here. One wide body Challenger and one regular Charger. Yeah, but you said you were trying to go look at the used cars they get? Yeah, I'm looking at the used cars. I can't afford these. <laughs> okay. So T looking at the used cars and we got the Mercedes right here on the Ruchis. What they say, Ruchi get your coochie. Uh, you trying to buy yourself a truck? You trying to be big dog? I am big dog. You are big dog. I was forty five. This is not that bad. Little puppy. If you put a lift, girl, get out these folks. <laughs> Man, if you put a lift kit on this truck, I can, that'll be funny as hell. Trying to see you get in and out of a truck with a lift on it. You're gonna have to get a running start. <laughs> <laughs> oh Lord. That's a car drop down. Yes. I'm um, there see I'm tired. Oh uh, no, you good. Be yourself. Hey, would you drive the Mustang Mach -E? The Mustang SUV? Yeah, I drive all the power out of it. All the juice. All the juice. All the energy, electricity and stuff. I don't know y'all, could y'all see me driving the Mustang Mach -E? How you gonna charge it up? You can charge it up at home. Charging these, charging electrified cars do not hurt your light bill. I think. I don't know. I want to find out. <laughs> My light bill down to three hundred dollars. Oh, uh, three hundred. Yes, it's two sixty-seven. This year? What's in? Wait, this month? Yeah. Damn. Exactly. That's what I said. The fuck keeping it up so high? What? What? The sink been fixed, so. Electricity. The electricity. I want every goddamn piece of electric everything off. It be off. Make sure that I, unpl I unplug it. <laughs> so yeah, y'all. No Mustang today. I'll probably try. Mm, someone is. <laughs> so I'll try to see another day. Okay. Nice bike. <laughs> So 
So what you about to get into? I'm about to go to the outside tonight. Outside? Oh, what's going on tonight? We have a slide show tonight. Well, we don't have a... Hold on, wait a minute. <laughs> we don't have a slide show, okay? They're having a slide show and I'm going. Where at? Well, I ain't going because now it's on film. My spirit will be there in the physical body. <laughs> Where at? Uh, oh, no. We gotta look at the fly. Yeah. Who knows? I might go partake in this as well. Be partake. By partake, I mean be... By partake, I may be there in spirit because I'm not sliding panda. I'm not going. The body of sneezing spirit will be there. Spirit, spirit. <laughs> yeah, well, we about to go. All right, y'all. <laughs> yeah, I'll get up with y'all later. Several days later. What's up, everyone, man? It is a week or so later, and we are headed back to Auto Nature for Wolf Chase because they finally have the cars in. The first part of the video. The cars weren't there because they was on order, like they was on the way, but they weren't there yet. Like they was in route, but they had the pictures on like cars.com and stuff as if they was there, but they weren't there, but now they are. They got one on the showroom and then I think they got a couple on the lot. So we better go see these 2024 Mustangs in person for the first time. So now let's head on back to Auto Nation Ford Wolf Chase. All right, here we are back at Auto Nation Ford Wolf Chase and I see a 2024 all the way over there, y'all. All the way over there. I think it's the Eco Boost, though. The dude did say they got one on the showroom floor. I'm gonna go see in just a second. But yeah. Oh, so this is how they look in person. Yeah, this is the Eco Boost one. Okay, I actually do like the front end of it. The front end is not that bad in person. It looks way different on camera but it's way better in person this is the eco boost and on and of course it's convertible i don't do convertible but huh so these are them they seem way shorter than they do in person like way shorter but yeah different front end this is my like i said this is my first time seeing one in person so it's different the lights okay then the lights actually are not that bad to me the lights look way different so that's what i'm gonna say pictures do not do this car justice seeing it in person is completely completely different that's what i'll say but yeah i actually like the car all right everyone and we inside now and here go with gt premium atlas blue so like I said, looking at it, I love this right here. The rear valence, like, I love this. Quad tip, so this means this has the active valve exhaust. Like I said, looking at the tail lights, pictures do not do this car just as me and the sales guy were just talking about it. When you see the tail lights on picture, they look big and bulky, but they're not. If I was to put my hand up by it, as you can see, like my hand isn't that big, but still though, that's actually decent size. The curve actually looks extremely good on it. They have their version of Brembo's, but they don't got the performance Brembo's that you can option in and get, which is what I did on mine, whenever my order were, whenever I get my freaking VIN number comes. Mm. But yeah. This is it. This is theirs in Atlas Blue. And it's nice. Let me look at the sticker of this thing. MSRP, ooh. 54000 dollars almost fifty-five for this car. Mmm. New car smell. And now, here goes the big controversial part, the big screen. Seeing the screen in person, the screen is nice. Everything is nice. Yeah, I can't wait for my order. Regular, I can tell he got the heated and cool seats. So this was a customer order, but he abandoned it. He didn't want it no more. So yeah, the big screen does 
it actually does look decent to me. Like I said, I can't wait for mine. Everything though, as you can see, analogs are not there no more, just very few. Everything is gonna be controlled by that middle screen right there, so yeah. And it's actually not in the way. A lot of folks from saying on video pictures saying that the screen would be in the way, it's not. Hmm. I actually like this touch right here too. The weave is nice. Let me close this gently. If I wasn't waiting on my exact order, I would pull the trigger on this one. But I really want the one that I spec'd out. I want it instead. Uh, all right, everyone, that's it for me going to go look at this 2024 Mustang. Seeing them in person, completely different. Like, they are completely different looking in person. Ooh, that sun all up in my eyes. But yeah, I'm about to head on to the house now. I got a dinner date. <laughs> But yeah, I cannot wait till mine come in. I'm just, I'm waiting on that color to come. Oof. I can't wait to reveal to y'all the color that I chose. But yeah, but yeah, I'm glad I ordered one. I just talked to dude, and so the, and so with the whole process of uh, ordering, it takes a month and a half, almost close to two months, just to re just to receive your VIN, and I ordered back. Ah, goddamn. Ooh. And I ordered back in August, so. It's August, September, probably in October is when I'm gonna receive my van. And so, like I was saying, I'm looking close to December to get the car probably, which ain't bad. So yeah, I'm uh, uh, I'm excited. I can't wait, but I, shall, I gotta go. Thank God for tuning in for this video. Peace. And I couldn't test drive cause they got the car blocked in and I don't want to test drive the EcoBoost over there because I want premium, I want V8. Yeah, maybe next time, if they get some more on the lot and like they just have them sitting out, I'll go test drive one somewhere. But, whew, like, shoot, like I said, I can't wait. All right, y'all, I'm out. I ain't gonna lie, you and your road rage be hilarious. Let them folks drive in peace. First off, we were in a very compromising position because both ways of flowing traffic, it just wasn't going to work out for us. So, any space and opportunity that we had, we needed to take it. And he was sitting there sitting. <laughs> <laughs> she has bad road rage. Oh. They said, what's up? We had smackers. <laughs>